What's up? This is David Banner, and you are looking at All Urban Central. Like when we create these things, when AK comes out with the with the keys chain, I mean with the keys, I mean, come on, man, it's just it's just super hard. First of all, and by the way, I don't know, I, I haven't told you that, but um, the chain is just super hard. Hey, it's just like thank you. It comes from a different place. It's it's beyond you know a show of wealth or mm -hmm. it, what people um, mm -hmm. tend to tend to uh, identify it as today. This thing comes back to. You know, like you said, Mansa Musa and all the great kings and, you know, from Ethiopia to Africa. So in case y'all been under a rock and you don't know, we connected, me and Mike connected on my album Keys. There's two sides to the album. It's a double album. The first side is the originals. The originals has that bluesy, soulful, original AK vibe. And then real Mike... Red, real red wine-ish, you know what I'm saying? Real red wine, fine with time. You see? Real real red wine-ish. Yes. And then me and Mike connected, sampled the originals and created Unlocked. And yeah. so the vibe is unbelievable. Yeah. <laughs> we, lit, we lit the gas with um with Unlocked. <laughs> we lit it up. For real. We lit it up. All right. So I thought that it'd be fun for us to like really deliver the two different worlds because it's Keysmas, and we want to give some gifts around here, and we're going to give the gift of music. Um, I like that. You know what I mean? It's Keysmas. Like they came up with it. They they fresh like oh. that. All right, so All right. so if you, so, which, so we're going to start with a song called Skydive. Basically, what's going to happen here is I'm going to play the original version right here, and Mike is going to play the unlocked version, and y'all get to tell us which version to you do you choose today? You know, they all fresh, so you can't lose. You can't lose. Can't all lose. right, so I'm gonna start. Skydive to me is about taking a leap. It's really about like going for it, even when you feel scared, but like believing that you can. Yes! That's a zone. That is a zone. All right, so what y'all got? Are we feeling. From what you heard, are you feeling skydive original or are you feeling skydive unlocked? <laughs> Look, his version's better. <laughs> I'm not I'm not gonna lie, it's just we just a duo we just a dynamic duo. You know what I'm saying? Deadly. It's like it's like, it's like it's like Snoop and Dre, you know what I'm saying? Like they love it when they come together. It is for sure. <laughs> for real. Nah, you listen, either way They're both. See, they said both. Let, we got we feeling unlocked today is both unlocked original. Well, you know what I'm saying. I like that. I like the quality vibe. Now, now, Mike, you know, one of the first songs that we did together was, if I remember, tell me if you remember different, but I remember it was "Is It Insane," mm -hmm. and um, it was the first one that we created the unlocked version for. And I was completely like, I remember that was the moment for me. That I knew that we had something special. Like that was the moment. Right. So, no, for sure. How do you remember it? I re I remember I remember the same thing. It was crazy because before I came to the studio that day, I was just listening to Porter's head, and then when I when I heard like "Is It Insane," it was so like slow and eerie. I was like, man, like if if she don't put any restraints on me right now, I could I could like really fuck this up. And then it was like the more. The more I started like trying to fuck it up and trying to add like my own element, the more you like, and that's why it just gelled so perfectly. And it's like, man, it was like as I was making the beat, you were sitting right there and you were like, "Yo, I like this, I like that." You were like, "Man, it reminds me of Portis head," and it was like, "Man, we just connected right there." And that's when we knew, like, man, okay, we're on the same wave. So it's like, yeah, I remember that. Is it insane? Special. Same vibes. <laughs> So crazy. So I think that we should do that one next. Let's do Is It Insane. All right, for sure. You gonna play or I'm gonna play? I'm you know, we let we we let you come come in the end. You know what I mean? Let them hear what I heard. Is it insane? 
what i had to work with right there <laughs> it was a diamond you brought me a diamond mm. and told me to make jewelry mm. Midas. i keep telling you this over and over like mm. it was already a diamond i was like man okay man let, let us get to work on this one shout out to my boy p nancy he had that player come through and right. you know what i'm saying we got real musical like real like trap billy holiday real like bluesy um, basement vibes, you know what I'm saying? Like, no more. Jeez. Nah, my favorites right there, man. And I appreciate God. you allowing me to put that bounce on there and letting us just spread our wings and go crazy on there. Like that, like that's like one of them songs that you could be like, ah, I don't want this touch, but it's like, man, we were we were able to take it to another world and create another masterpiece. So. Man, this is like one of my favorite joints. Isn't it insane to me? It's so special. It just has a has such a classic, timeless energy, and what you put on it is just make twist it up. All right, so what's it gonna be? Is it gonna be? Is it insane original, or is it gonna be? Is it insane unlocked? We're talking about the Keys album, and we got the two sides. Mike represents unlock. I represent original. So what y'all going for on? Is it in Insane. Look, they just like look. This the whole thing is fire. <laughs> is what it is. You know what I mean? This the vibe is incredible. It really is. Hey, you got a lot. We got original. We just got both. I gotta say, I love them both. They both just take you to a world. All right, we gonna play one more for the people, Mike. So yeah. we gonna play one more. We can either let them decide or you can decide. It's up to you. We can either do. Um, only you, or we could do Nat King Cole. What you think? Um, my bad, somebody had called. Um, <laughs> um, Always. I, got, I, got, I got the I got the whole album on repeat, so it's like I think they can they can decide. Like, I would what play yeah, what y'all think? They saying billions, but we ain't talking about billions. We talking about. Nat King Cole, or they do love Daffodils, by the way, Mike. Damn. Daffodils is a favorite. I love that version of Daffodils that you did. We got, a, a, we got some Only Use. We got some Nat King Coles. What you want, Mike? Because this is a celebration of our record, and I'm loving it. We, got, we just got to put that Nat King Cole, because it's like, I feel like, man, I feel like, man, we, we, we really deserve our flowers after that. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> yes, like, it's, it's you and Lil Wayne on the track. Like, this is a very important moment for, like, the culture, just for music, just for, in general, hip-hop, just for, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, everything. And I feel like it's a new sound. And I feel like, man, it's just so many layers to this. It's like me, it's Mars, it's you, it's, mm. it's Lil Wayne, yeah. it's you again. You know what I'm saying? It's, yeah. man, it's like putting the time in the timeless. It's like what this what this song represents and um Thomas. like like yeah it's just like man this was like super special and what, what was my guy's name that played the upright bass my bad i don't want to get it wrong you know what i don't want to get it wrong either but he's incredible and i'm gonna make sure that i tag him when i post this because for sure that's our guy we got to drop that video footage with him in this in the studio playing it that's just he was like, yeah just putting this song together but the layers on this it's um special, but I'm playing that King Cole. You playing it first? No, no, no. I go first, then you. Okay, my bad. My bad. You know what I'm saying? 